Hey guys, how's it going? Tears back again with another episode of the mini series at the 2014 World Cup. We are through to the semi final against Spain with France. Now, of course, the last episode was the quarter final, went down extremely well, obviously ended in dramatic fashion. If you missed that quarter final, I highly recommend that you check that live come out. There will be a link in the description to it and an annotation on screen in the bottom left hand side of the video. But uh, we're going to jump straight into this one on the uh, semi final stage against Spain. We're missing. Um, Sami Nasri and Frank Ribery both through injury, so it's going to be an extremely tough tie. That's our starting lineup. As you can see, we're still very, very strong. I've got Kabai sat behind Benzema, and I've got Bia Biani in for the injured Ribery, and then it is the exact same 11 that we've been playing through the knockout stages with those two changes aside. Let's have a look at Spain's starting lineup Casillas, Aspilicueta, Mikel San Jose at centre back alongside so Sergio Ramos. Big, uh, big decision there from, from El. Oh, who's the who's the manager? Um, Vicente Del Bosque, isn't it? Uh, Jordi Albert left back. Wamata holding, really? Okay, so we've got a very very attacking midfield three again. With uh, as with the previous one, I'm going to try and keep this video uh, shorter than the 20 minutes that the group stage one was. The 10 minute uh, 10 minute quarter final went down very very well indeed. Like I say, loads of likes, loads of feedback in the comments, and I do apologise if uh, your ears were offended by the uh, but. Oh, I nearly got around the corner there. If your ears were offended by the um, by the screaming, etc., and the uh, the rather loud outbursts whenever goals went in, etc., but you know it's the World Cup. It's exciting times, and I'm gonna get excited. Can we get Benzema around that corner? We might be able to pay attention to the ball. Please carry him. Matuidi took a bite. I'm gonna give that a whack. Bibiani's nicked it off. Jordi Alba there. I'm gonna try and find Benzema at the back post. It's a good ball in. Kabai's on it, we'll get the turn in. This time can we get an unblocked shot on target? We can! Oh, Johan Kabai! It's 1-0 to France after just 7 minutes! What a great start to the semi-final, boys! That is absolutely superb! Sammy Nesri never did that, why haven't I been starting Kabai all the way through? It's a fantastic finish, it was all about that turn, just to get away from the defender, then pull it back across goal, goalkeeper, no chance. Wonderful start to this semi-final. Pedro bringing down the right hand side. A little bit nervous because he's got good feet. Here's a ball back to Dave. That's a good whip. Oh, I don't want to let them get on the end of those crosses, especially when it's Soldado. He's done so well for us in the Tottenham career mode so far this season. By the way, uh, either tomorrow or Thursday there will be big Tottenham career mode news coming. Do be aware of that. Paye. Got a run from Kabai. I've got a man over. Where's Biabiani? Wait for it, wait for it. Uh, wasn't quite the uh, the through ball I was expecting. Bibiani, he's going to go all the way. I'm going to cut back and then we're going to cross it. Goodbye. Oh, it's blocked. Decent chance. Benzema, I want to get the turn again and then try that similar shot. It's a good, great tackle. Benzema still got the feet. Can't get the finish in. I don't like these through balls. Come on, and Andres, what you got? Well in, Matcha. Great tackle from Debushi there. Iniesta, they're using Iniesta quite a lot down this. Uh, my right hand side, their left hand side. We've seen a lot of the ball so far, and uh, trying to catch him on a counter attack with Biabiani down that side. Well played, and Via. Not so well played, and Via. Never mind. The chance goes begging. Wow, that was uh, that was a little bit nervy. And Via did fantastically well to slide in to get the ball back, and then just didn't show any sort of physical presence whatsoever, and got shoved off the ball stupidly easily. Just give up now, and let's have half time, and then I can take the lead into the break. Deflection, corner to Spain. Right, I want Mangala or uh, or Lauren Crescioni to get on the end of this. Mangala's won the first one. There's the second effort, and Lloris holds on very, very well indeed. Oh, that was a little bit closer than I may have liked it to be. Go on, Cleese, play the ball around the corner. Paye. Go on in, Dave, what you got? Oh, he's got good tackles, what he's got. <laughs> And that looks as if that's going to be half time. So after a fantastic start, the set, the uh, the rest of the first half kind of petered out a little bit. There weren't that many chances. A couple of opportunities either side, but uh, we go in at half time in this semi final, the Rio 2014 World Cup. It's France one, Spain nil. Spain are throwing everyone forward at me. Really are on the offensive now. You can see every time I get the ball, look how high their midfield line is. They're just pressuring, pressuring the ball all the time. They want to get themselves back in this game, as you can well understand. It's a World Cup semi-final, and they're losing one nil, and there's less than half an hour left. One of Benzema will have a turn and a Kabai. 
McTweedy. We've got a man over. Can I find the gap? <gasps> Paye. Compose yourself. Finish it. Save. Benzema. 2-0. France 2. Spain 0. Benzema will have a cheeky salute, Sunshine. It is... Yes! That is almost, almost a certain place in the final for us at France 2014. It's fantastic. At first time of asking as well. well. This is the first ever international tournament that I've ever done. Either recorded or non-recorded in any FIFA ever. And we're actually 2-0 up in a semi-final against Spain. I cannot believe my luck, honestly. This has been absolutely superb so far. Do feel free. If you made it this far through... Oh, God. If you made it this far through the video, then please feel free to leave the video a like if you could be so kind. They're bringing on Alvaro Negredo for Roberto Soldado. Let's try and get this to 35 to 40 likes if we possibly can. The last two have made that margin, which has been absolutely superb. And if we can keep this up and actually get all the way to the final, then I definitely think that makes that deserves another like. Paye. Oh, nice Ronaldo chop. Ref? Okay. Piabiani. I might make some changes in a minute just to freshen things up. Perhaps we'll bring Paul Pogba on like we did in the quarter final. Just to try and freshen things up in the midfield. Oh, and yes, sir, that ball roll has completely done me. Jordi Alba's in. Great block. Fantastic defending from Gail Cleesey. And we might have them on the uh, on the counter-attack again. It's Biabiani's pace. Breaking down inside the left-back. Jordi Alba looks like he's run out of... Uh, Run out of stamina, stands it up, Benzema's there! Oh, it's three, this is an absolute rout. Easy, so easy, carrying Benzema, it's France, three, Spain, nil. The pace of Biabiani has been absolutely crucial down that right-hand side. It's been instrumental to everything we've been doing going forward. Absolutely fantastic replacement for the ends of Frank Ribery. Really stated a case for uh, perhaps a start in the final, should Ribery actually be back from injury in time. May have to start... Uh, Bia Biani because he's just been superb and uh, Paye has been so much more effective on that left hand side than he has been previously on the right that I, I may start him out on the left hand side for uh, for the final as well because you can probably safely say that we are going to make the final now Karim Benzema looking for Bia Biani again it's going to go out but 3-0 uh, lead with uh, with just 10-15 to 15 minutes left on the clock I think it's safe to say we're going to be through to the final of this boys absolutely fucking superb Three minutes of stoppage time then at the end of the second half in this France versus Spain World Cup 2014 semi-final. It's been a dominant display from us this uh, this particular game. I've been really, really impressed with the, with the way my players have stepped up after Argentina ran us extremely close in that quarter-final. And uh, Chile, in fact, gave us a decent game as well. But uh, we've been really, really good in this one. I've been extremely pleased with the way the replacements are coming for the injured players. Kabai and Biabiani have put in stellar performances. And that is us through to the final of the Brazil World Cup. Fantastic. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Please do feel free to leave the video a like if you could be so kind. The other semi-final is between Belgium and Brazil. So we, we, we will be meeting either the hosts or our final group stage opponents, Belgium, again. Now, of course, we, uh, we did win that game. So we finished top of the group against Belgium. So confident against Belgium, but Brazil whole different kettle of fish but that is us through to the final so thank you very much for watching guys please feel free to leave the video a like as i have asked before show us some support with a comment as well let me know what you think of this whole fifa world cup mini series as a whole and i will see you tomorrow with the final